Welcome back. In the previous part, Song went off somewhere inside the temple and we're basically chasing after him right now. I don't know what's going on out there though. There's something going on with the Turks and Vincent. I would like to see what, but we've got to find out where Song went right now. Oh no, another inverted pyramid. They always worry me. Here we go. In his footsteps. Huh. Hall of Resurrection. Resurrection? Whose resurrection? Built like a maze, remnants of battle. It's not a temple, it's a fortress. To defend against what though? Fiends? Worse, humans. <coughs> humans feared and coveted the power of the ancients. And so they slaughtered them. <coughs> Sephiroth. Sephiroth. <coughs> Don't be afraid. It's not death. It's a homecoming. Well, that sounds familiar. You'll see him soon enough. I mean, again, that happened in the original Final Fantasy VII with Sung, but at a different point. So... Oh! Here's the clock, isn't it? With the different rooms. This is the clock puzzle. That I was hoping would still be here somewhere. It's this. This is, this is, this is the room. Oh! <laughs> Uh, uh, yeah, Song's gravely injured right now, yes. We're, we're being serious about this. Song! You okay? It's not me you should be worried about. Just tell me... <coughs> this place... Is it... Promised land. I'm sorry, but I don't think it is. Of course, figures. <clears throat> Always did take my word for it. <laughs> I never hated you, you know. <laughs> this pedestal's a key. One only an ancient can use. <laughs> Where are you going? Got a report to make. <laughs> Aerith. I need you. Ah, Cloud is just so harsh right now. Okay. What's it say? O oh, warrior, weary though thou art, inward, must thou now turn. Reflect on thy long and bloody path, and kindle life's fire anew. Forget not thine ire, for it shall 
remake thee. What does that mean? Rolling out the red carpet for us? Sorta. We're each supposed to face some kind of trial. I guess you get to sit this one out. <sighs> Typical. I'll wait out here. But make it quick. Well, no point delaying the inevitable. Right. Why not Cloud, though? See you on the other side. Okay. So everyone's wandering off to their own separate ones. Again, why? Why not you, Cloud? Like, you guys should be questioning this a bit more, I feel. Oh, well. So what kind of trial are we going to have, though? That's the question. What is this? Good question. Big head. Big head. Feels like it should be a trial unique to each person, though. Well, it seems to be in some regard the trial of Red 13. It can't be real. You can hear a helicopter, sir. This seems wrong. This is... Hojo's lab. Well, oh, there's Hojo. Specimen. It must be handled with the utmost care. Type. So, all I'm thinking is, what about the guy on the left? What about the guy on the left? Both at the same, yeah, both at the same time. Come along, number 13. Don't be shy. It's not about being shy. Be honest, Red, at this point, why are you not launching yourself at them? Because you easily could. That's a good boy. Make sure he's strapped down tight. Look at such a fine red coat. A rare specimen for my lucky 13th test. 
Henceforth, you shall be Red Thirteen. Shall we then? Oh, Red. <laughs> Damn. And you have to relive that. Because that's his trial. Oh. It is like they're being drugged, right? Nibelheim. But when? Could we explore around here? I like how it's actually cut off. Like the rest of the world is not there. It is just Nibelheim. Yeah, I know. I know game. But you know I want to look over there and see what else is around. There could be clues to something. I don't know what the something would be. But something. What about... Cloud's house at this point. Nope. Okay. Anything in there? Doesn't seem to be anything. Same screechy noise that Sephiroth causes to Cloud. No. Like I saw Cloud go this way. Wait. Dad? Where did Cloud go? It's very strange, this part of the story. I mean, that's just going to be the reactor, isn't it? It's, it's truncating the story. There is no Nibelheim. I was expecting Cloud to turn up and I wanted to see what would happen. Oh, I 
I think we know where we are right now in terms of Yuffie's story. I think. This is fine. Not scary at all. That's scary. Oh yeah. I forgot she had the climbing sections. Put the claws away, boss. At least while we're in Shimmer territory. So not. Not that way then. Around the edge. Hey, boss. Want to try treading a little lighter this time? No point fighting if you don't have to. Boss, I don't think we'll be back here anytime soon, so make sure you're ready for anything, okay? What's the purpose of these trials, though? Like, why, why, why go down memory lane? With some of these characters. The grapple icon. There we go. Like I'd, I'd forgotten certain aspects of that story, like the climbing, for instance. I didn't think we'd see you. <laughs> At least not until we got to Vincent's stuff. If you won't come and claim him, I can always keep him from myself. <laughs> but again, why are you making them go back through this stuff? What purpose does it serve? It's gonna be Corel. I was thinking it was gonna be something with Avalanche, like Jesse, Biggs, Wedge, but of course, Corel. Of course. I'm home. Almost. Hey, Barrett, home. welcome home. Thanks for looking out, Barrett. How's the reaction? Everything's gotten so much easier thanks to that reactor. Everything's good, thanks to you. You're aching for a nice hot shower. Oh, there you are. <laughs> What's wrong, baby? You okay? Hmm? Burn! 
<laughs> What's gotten into you? <laughs> All right, let's get you inside. Someone's clearly had a long day. Okay. And then it's all gone. Oh, damn. Myrna? Myrna! 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 God, just making them relive this stuff, it's just... Horrible. I thought Reds was bad, and now we've got to Barrett's. It's like, oh, damn. They put the stump right in your face. Where are you, baby? See, this, this, this is kind of like, like I was saying when we were doing the Karel stuff, I felt like it didn't have the same weight. Coming. It's, I feel like they saved it for now. Because we didn't see much of the town or anything being destroyed, or the people. When we were doing the dying stuff, it's like, oh. Here we go. Are we going this way, or... Because then I can sort of see why they'd wait if they had this planned. Out of my way. Because that way they kept it very focused on dying, and here it's Barrett's loss. Myrna. Wake up, baby. Wake up. Don't leave me. Not again. <laughs> Kinda makes sense why we can't see clouds now. We kind of already know what that is, right? Well, we do anyway. Stopping at Sector 4, Undercity. Sector 4, Undercity. around here. Without the men in white and the needles, would you get better there? There's a chicken there. Yes, sweetheart. I think I would. And let's go. I'm liking how there's a little connection there to 
what we saw in Remake. With the sort of painting on the walls in her cell. Mommy, does it hurt? I'm sorry, sweetie. I'm spoiling our adventure. Just wait here, alright? I'm gonna find a doctor. Huh? Hello? Go on. Oh, They just walked past. When, where did they go? The trial of Erif, though. Could anybody help? Just keep wandering off until it stops me. Like, I, I see it in the bottom left in case you're wondering. I'm just seeing how far I can get. It does seem like this is the end and it's going to block you. Yeah. Can you help me? Yeah, whatever. Stay down, brat. Dude. <laughs> what a dick. Where's Almira, though? Are you okay? There she is. Doctor around here? I'm sorry, honey, but I don't know. I'm not from this part of town. Oh, okay. Go with her. Make sure she's okay. I mean, we know she does. I could help you look, though. No, thank you. Have to go. I don't want to leave my mom alone too long. Your mother? Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, mommy. I tried. This isn't going to be good for little Aerith at all. Just isn't. I'm glad Almira is around at this point. Wait, there's a trooper there. I really, really tried. Wait, you saw her and did nothing? You did nothing? Dude! Ah, it just makes it so much harsher. Oh. Can't believe no one around here would just think to help or look for help. Other than Almira, of course. Mom! Aerith. Mommy has to return to the Good old Amara. Here she is. What about our adventure? <sighs> Miss, do you need help? Please take care of somewhere safe. <sighs> We need 
to go. Mom! It's not safe here. The white materia. Yeah, that one stings quite a bit for me. For obvious reasons. Let me guess, Hojo? Oh, no. Hey, she's over here. Oh. Oh yeah, it kind of makes sense with the Hall of Resurrection now. It's resurrecting your memories in a way, isn't it? Oh. But the clock hands are still turning then. Really would be interested to see if we had one for Cloud. What would he face? What would he see? Is this his? You know, if you think about it. Life and death are just two sides of the same coin. Our bodies may disappear when we die, but our spirits still live on. We return to the planet, rejoin the life stream, and in time give rise to new life. In time, yeah. I get it, I really do. Knowing that the people we love aren't really gone, it doesn't make it any easier to let them go. It still hurts. So we can't just think of it as a homecoming, because it's not that simple. We've all experienced pain. We all have our regrets. What we've done, what's been done to us, that's set in stone. The past is forever. But the future, even if it has been written, can be changed. It's true that the pain and the anger we carry can make us stronger. But at what cost? What toll does it take? I believe true strength doesn't come from any of that. True strength comes from our ability to forgive. To forge ahead in the hope of making things right. It comes from ourselves. So focus on the future, not the past. Do that, and not even Sephiroth will be able to stand in our way. Not even him. Are you finished? Damn, dude! Clock's ticking. Come on. Yeah. I know. Ooh, I've got thoughts about this now. Which... Which relate to my own thoughts and feelings of things that have happened in my life recently. You know, like losing my own mum last year it it's 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 something i've thought about with final fantasy 7 the original one it was all about like that we'll, we'll stand still for this while i discuss this it very much 
had this sense to it. It was looking at the idea of how loss affects you and how it can cripple you. Because that was that was Cloud's issue. This is why I was kind of sort of like worried where they were going to go with the story with Cloud because it very much was a focus on how the depression hit him at the loss of Zack. There was other things as well. I don't want to say there wasn't other things that caused Cloud to have a nervous breakdown in the original Final Fantasy VII. There was. But the final nail in the coffin for him and his sanity was basically the loss of his best friend, Zack. Like, that's what did it and how he was trying to deal with that and eventually come to terms with it. That was part of the story, like a big significant part of the story. And they sort of changed that. And I was worried where they were going to go with that because that was such a nice key point of the original story. But now at this point, it's like the, it's more they've pushed that aspect of Cloud's story to everyone else as well. They've each got some sense of loss and how it affects them and how they're dealing with it. And then Eris' little speech there about how to process that and move forward. That seems something new for Rebirth, which is interesting because that to me kind of explains the name of the game. Everyone. It's the name of the game, everyone. It, It's just the aspect of like, yeah, you've been rebirthed. Because cause it, it was all about like this idea of like the, the live stream and it was a cycle. Like death happens and then things are reborn. Life carries on. But it's the choice to move forward. That choice for rebirth. I I like that aspect from Aerith there, what she brought up. Which is why it was like, Cloud, dude! I'm wondering where they're going to go with Cloud's story at this point. But I am I am glad they've still got that aspect elsewhere that was so good about the original Final Fantasy VII. Because I was, I was worried they were, they were just going to sort of like miss that point somehow. In there. But no, they've, they've still got it and they, they've made it significant to the other characters as well. Because I very much felt it with Barrett's story. It's like, oh, dude, like, like seeing how happy you were to see her again. And then she was snatched away again. It's like, yeah, that's that's not nice at all. And obviously the one I resonated with quite a bit, because again, of my own loss myself, was Aerith. Like her being there when her mum died. And seeing that again, it's like, oh god. Horrible. Horrible. But the fact she took something good away from it. I like that. I like that. Because I'd honestly say I've not really had... A sense of the air if I knew from the original game. In Remake and Rebirth. That much, really. It's sort of like, eh, you don't kind of feel the same until now. It's like, nah, 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 now, now you feel like Aerith to me. Now you do. Having seen you go through that. And your outlook after it. No, I really like your character. No, I really like your character. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, Yuffies we'd been through ourselves. Red was just, that was just horrible for him. Tifa's we knew about. But it's, it's very much like Barrett's and Aerith's. They were significant. They were significant. I still find it interesting we haven't seen clouds though. Yeah. Anyway, just a lot of random thoughts there. But we are going to end this part here. I wonder if I can go back. Actually. Rest at the rest stop again. This is back, right? Wait, is this back? Because this seems different. Where is this? Wait. Did we come out of here? That feels weird. Although, unless... Yeah, with everything changing and turning in here... 
may not have been the way we came from. What? 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 what, what, what what's down here? Are these the people's trials? What about the other doors? Shrine of Trials. But yeah, I, re I really, really do like what they, they did here. And it makes sense why it's called the Hall of Resurrection. That makes sense now. And again, speaks to the name of the game, which is Rebirth. But anyway, we're going to end this part here now. And in the next part, we'll carry on down over there, wherever down over there is. Where it's pointing us. We'll see you in the next part. Ta-da for now.